It's a last tango in Paris for the 2023 Rugby World Cup. South Africa against New Zealand. Who will stand alone? Alert to the danger is Cody Taylor. Shannon Frizzell, okay, so number six. Number Real. six drops his weight onto the leg, so that is foul play. That's not an attempt to roll. So we do have foul play. Do we agree with that? Agreed. Well, that is just the start that the All Blacks didn't want inside two and a half minutes. Andre Pollard has the first points of the World Cup. Andre Pollard to continue his 100% kicking rate at this World Cup. Only the second time of the final that New Zealand have been into the Springbok 22. Advantage, advantage. Advantage All Blacks. Richie Moonga gets the All Blacks on the board in the World Cup final. Pollard from long range. Flags are up. Straight either. That's another give back. Yes, we do, yeah. Okay, the yellow card has been reviewed and it's been upgraded. To it's, red. it's upgraded to red. It's a high degree of danger and there's no mitigation. Disaster for New Zealand. As Andre Pollard aims at post once again and it's the same old story. Mawanga adds three points for the All Blacks. Taylor goes long to Sevilla. So he is at fault, so there is foul play. Yep. Okay, and he's run from the distance and he's head on head contact. So agreed, minimum yeah. yellow card for that, isn't it? Yes, agreed. And it's tough to see a Kulisi because he's coming in with his head down to make that shot. It's that good. Mawanga. Jordy Barrett, huge pass over the top to Mark Talia, who gets away from one and another. Mark Talia takes it ball from Jordy Barrett over the top, the left foot step, the right hand fin, the ball through contact, goes backwards. Bowden Barrett picks the ball up and finishes. Lobs it over to Anton Leonard Brown. Leonard Brown offloads. Okay, so Cheslin Colby. This time, time. Jordy time. Barrett to put the All Blacks in front. And he's missed it. New Zealand looking for the steal here, right at the end of this test match. But it's over! It's over! It's a fourth Rugby World Cup for South Africa.